Today's Sunshine Note is titled, Seek as for Hidden Treasure. The kingdom of heaven is like treasure hidden in a field. When a man found it, he hid it again, and then in his joy went and sold all he had and bought that field. Matthew chapter 13 verse 44 Geocaching is a game of hiding and seeking. Some geocaches are very easy to find, others are deliberately more difficult. Sometimes the difficulty comes from a devious hide. I remember one notorious catch that stumped many geocachers for a long time. It consisted of a piece of silver duct tape stuck to the bottom of a guardrail. Many catchers kept trying and trying until it was finally located. Another memorable catch was hidden in the vicinity of a railroad caboose, and it was so difficult that six months went by before it was found. In other cases, puzzles must be solved in order to determine the coordinates of the catch. It may be necessary to do some internet research, decode a message, or figure out clues hidden on the catch listing page. For catchers who enjoy that sort of thing, the reward is usually the feeling of accomplishment for having conquered a challenge. Jesus talked about seeking for hidden treasure. He suggests that we seek God's kingdom as diligently as we might search for buried treasure or for a challenging geocache. His parable illustrates the value of heavenly treasure and the effort that should be made to secure it. Just as a geocatcher might struggle to solve a puzzle or make repeated attempts to find a catch, the seeker of a heavenly treasure must be willing to go to great lengths to gain the treasure of truth. The treasure Jesus refers to is no mere trinket, no fleeting sense of accomplishment. The value of this treasure is above gold or silver. The riches of earth's mines cannot compare with it. The Bible is the mine of the unsearchable riches of Christ. But it takes earnest study and close investigation to uncover the treasures in God's Word. Just as a half-hearted effort will not solve a challenging puzzle, so we cannot expect to gain spiritual knowledge without earnest toil. Those who desire to find the treasures of truth must dig for them as the miner digs for the treasures hidden in the earth. It is essential for old and young not only to read God's word, but to study it with wholehearted earnestness, praying and searching for truth as for hidden treasure. The reward will be the riches of eternal life. The kingdom of heaven is like treasure hidden in a field. When a man found it, he hid it again, and then in his joy went and sold all that he had and bought that field. Matthew chapter 13 verse 44. May God bless you today.